of Hillel members held their second annual leadership dinner, but they say this year was more important than ever. TV20's Kayla Lewis tells us how leaders at UF have responded to reports of anti-Semitism. Speech is protected, violence is not, vandalism is not. UF President Ben Sass addressed the crowd while being honored at UF Hillel's leadership dinner. He was given a golden bagel for his continued support of Jewish students since the war in Gaza broke out more than 100 days ago. At the University of Florida, we reject any determinisms that reduce men and women to predetermined immutable categories. He says he supports students' First Amendment rights but will never support violence and hate. I mean, the community here has been absolutely incredible. It feels so nice to have so many people in my corner. Sass says he even personally paid to replace a banner outside a Jewish fraternity after it was vandalized four times. One student tells me she never thought something like this would happen to Jews again after the Holocaust, but feels grateful for the community and leadership at UF. I have felt fear, just as I'm sure Jewish people felt 80 years ago. This dinner kicked off the Spread Cream Cheese Not Hate initiative, which started back in 2020 to go along with National Bagel Day to start conversations about anti-Semitism. So I feel really lucky to go to UF and have that support for my um, administration because I don't know what I would do if I didn't. Shelby Schultz took a trip to Poland over winter break to see Holocaust camps. It just brought a whole new meaning, thinking that something like that is happening today and people are still being persecuted just because they are Jewish. Um, it doesn't matter how much time has passed. On Wednesday, more than 325 students will go around campus to hold conversations and collect pledges. Make sure that everybody knows that never again is now. 62 campus organizations are partnering with Halal for the initiative. In Gainesville, Kayla Lewis, TV, 20 News.